ждали, вы просили, и сегодня мы идем в гости к капитану ЖФК ЦСКА, футболистке сборной Сербии Невене Дамьянович. Поддержите и это видео лайком и комментарием, так мы будем знать, что нам стоит продолжать эту рубрику. Смотрите видео внимательно, Невена задаст вам очень интересный вопрос, и мы подарим подарок тому, кто первым правильно ответит на него. Ну что ж, утро капитана начинается в 5 утра и не с кофе. Поскакали смотреть. Good morning, good people. It's 5.30, so let's train together. Sorry, I wake you up so early. Uh, But... well... It's not a problem. When you ask me, I say like, no problem, just come. I think it will be a great content. <laughs> yeah, come on. Let's see <laughs> if we, people will like it. When, when I have sun, see, this is the spot where, where I do warm up. Now I will show you. We need this phone and then, you know, it's really important morning sun. <laughs> and then I appreciate every moment in life. I start like that. Couple of minutes, see. It's perfect. And then we start to work. What Two. time uh, do you usually w wake up? Uh, five. But it's like now we have uh, early uh, training. So I just move a little bit earlier and uh, that I can do gym and then I can go for training because I'm just used to it. But uh, when we have afternoon, then I have more time. So I come around seven, 7.30 at the gym. If you get up uh, at five, in what time uh, should go you to sleep. go to sleep? So I will leave my phone around 9.30. Let's call it my family. <laughs> Everything is okay. Then I leave my phones and then I read a book and then when I fell asleep, fell asleep. But uh, gen generally I don't need so much sleep. Like six, seven hours for me, it's okay. What I'm doing, so the most important, I feel good, you know, free of injury. Yeah, I take care about my body, so I know how I feel. I know when I need to slow down. I know when I can push, so it's good. So yes, we finished training. Now we can start the day. Come on to see real life of Nena. <laughs> Come on. So welcome, welcome, welcome. It's really important uh, to have a good vibe, and with music everything is better. If you want reality. Literally like this. Everything needs to be perfect. Someone will say I'm perfect and no. I just like to be everything good. Good people, good morning again. So when I come from the gym, I make a really good coffee. It's just coffee, but I put a lot of coffee. So come on, I am using Nescafe. And the question is for you, how many scoops I put? I will show you the glass in this glass. But that is the question, you cannot see. Right. I'm literally uh, addicted to coffee. <laughs> you know, before I was drinking so much coffee, when I'm in Serbia, like our lifestyle is like, in, in Serbia I just drink coffee and enjoy life. So I drink a lot of coffee and enjoy life. But uh, here now, because, we, because of trainings and everything, morning coffee and I'm done with caffeine because I want to sleep good, like, after. So what? They think how much I put. You know, if uh, our fans love this video, <laughs> please like and subscribe. And maybe I will open a YouTube channel. Hmm. I will think about it. You know, if they like it. Did you have a breakfast today? Or after the gym? You want or to before explain, the gym? You want to explain you my nutrition? Come on. Today was easy training. And then when I come, I already have prepared my breakfast. I will show you what I eat. It's really important nutrition. That's, I think, hardest part for me because I like to eat 
and I eat, eat a lot. So now everything what I eat, you know, like not now, like long time ago, you have an app. So my breakfast, it will be like around 500 calories. And I have a lot of protein, a lot of carbs because we go for training. Yeah, I, I take care about nutrition because it's really important how you will recover. And uh, I can make a, like literally one episode uh, what I do. And so fans, if you want to know more, I'm coach. Coach Nena, if you want personal trainings, uh, please contact me. Personal trainings, uh, plan of nutrition, no problem. You know that I finished uh, some course for uh, personal coach? Yeah. When was Corona? What is your breakfast uh, consist from? Yes, I, uh, the most of the time I eat uh, oats. Yes, I look like this. You just open. If you want more energy, you put some maybe banana. I put peanut butter. And this is the breakfast for me. It's tasty and it's easy. Recipe for this. Mm -hmm. So you put oats, then I put chia seed, then I put whey protein, white chocolate taste, amazing, amazing. So then I put um, cocos milk, then you stir that up, a little bit of Greek yogurt and blueberries. And then you stir up that really nice, nice, nice. You cover that, put it in the fridge overnight. In the morning, it's ready. And it's really nice, you know. And after the training, I don't need to think, oh, I need to cook or not. I just take, I eat, and I'm ready for another training. I'm filming. <laughs> so, <laughs> of course, you feel healthy. Gym in the morning, healthy food. I'm proud. It is so good. I also see the book on the uh, sofa. My books is uh, in charge of my sister Maria. I love you, Maria, you know that, but she's in charge of my books. So this is like what I already read. And uh, I read a lot of about philosophy now. Tell us a top three books. Yeah, that's difficult, no. This is like favorite player, man. I mean, it's difficult. But I like good books, probably. Yeah, I like this uh, author. It's you Nespe. Every book, it's amazing. It's about Detective Hule. Oh, amazing. Read, read, read people. It's really important. But yes, I read a lot. I love it. So uh, let's go next uh, to your shelf. This so. is the uh, recovery part. So you have two type of foam roller. So then, of course, you have... You know who likes this ball? Booba. Diana Jankovic, she loves it. Then uh, I have a massage pistol. This is like the bigger one, smaller one. Then I have my uh, recovery boots. They're here, they're laying down. <laughs> so always when I come after the gym, probably I will drink coffee and I will be in recovery boots. Also you have uh, a lot of watches and glasses. Tell us something wait, wait, about wait. your collection. <laughs> wait, I don't have so much. In Serbia I have a couple of more. But uh, yes, it's it's not so so expensive. But uh, yeah, I like to buy a watch. So. Which uh, one is your favorite? Oh, this one. This one definitely. Uh, it's working. It's automatic. When you put on wrist, it's working. <laughs> don't don't think it's not working. Yeah, this is my favorite. And this is like my earrings. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I have a lot of earrings. Sunglasses, of course. Sun is coming. I bring here only what I like, literally need. This is my headphones. Listen now, this is like uh, for gym, like strength training. This is for running. You know, when you run, you need to have this one. And uh, this is for podcast. <laughs> when you're walking. GPS, if you want to see how much I run. And this is uh, for my heart rate. Small, you know, I like minimalistic, I don't like uh, a lot of things, so I like everything to be like in the order how I like, so. Um, also, you have some awards here and uh, in the other room. Yes, so, see how this is beautiful. Yeah, see? which one uh, is uh, uh, the most important for you? You know, the most important when you want something like a thing. Individuals, uh, price for me, it's something like it's of course nice, but it's not my priority because in the end, when I finish my career, it will be like you won championship, you won. No one will say like, ah, you were one of the best 11. Who cares? But it's about uh, 
what you achieve like a team. My sister likes to collect that. I am not crazy about it. For me, it's the most important, like what we want, like a team. This is like from from last year. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, in the circle of stars. Uh, yeah. Do you feel like a star. <laughs> I know. I don't. I like stars. <laughs> I don't feel like a star. But a lot of people think that I'm like star. No, I don't feel like that. So let's see your clothes. Oh, <laughs> come on, let's see. Uh, I don't have uh, so much clothes here. You know, my sister lives in Belgrade and uh, my parents are in my hometown, Kragovac. So literally I have everywhere my clothes and they're like, what we can do with that? I was like, I don't know when I come and you know, we don't have so much free time. So you like shopping? No, I don't like, no, I don't like shopping. I like good clothes. But uh, for shopping, uh, the most of the time I just, um, I know in what I want to buy and I just go and buy. But to shopping, one hour, two hours to walk and just to compare if it's this better, no way. So show us. Oh, no, but here it's like more only like uh, my casual clothes, you know. So I have, of course, t-shirts. You know, I don't have so much clothes here because like I go on training and I go back. I have just a lot of hoodies, different colors. I love this one. What is your favorite casual look? Oof, I, now I'm like, uh, I like to wear uh, oversized uh, t-shirts. I don't know why, I just started. It's like present from my friend. So it's uh, meaning good vibe. So probably wear this today. What do you think about luxury brands? Do you like it or? You know, I'm not about like, you know, everything needs to be expensive to look good you know sometimes i go out in t-shirt like i don't know 10 euros and uh, i have probably more expensive things but i'm like i feel it and the most important how you look and your energy can you describe uh, your morning routine beauty procedure and something oh <laughs> no it's beauty it's like i have cold shower it's really good see this Yes, we are on, we are on, my friends, YouTube. <laughs> so yeah, I like perfumes, I like perfumes, so I love it. I love it. <laughs> yeah, I have another one, Valentina. Donna de Roma. Like, yeah, I have a lot of things. It's like a normal, nothing special. But uh, yes, when I prepare my uh, backpack for uh, the training, I'm like, I need this, I need this, I need this, and it's much easier. Tell us about your ideal day. I am near sea. Oh, I wake up really early and I make good coffee and then I watch sea with sunrise, you know, and I'm grateful and thankful and then uh, probably I will hit the gym <laughs> again. The ideal uh, day for me it's like uh, when I'm with my family. My family is uh, really important for me. I'm here because of them, because of their unconditional love and support. My sister for me it's, uh, is everything, my parents is everything. So. Yeah, I miss them, but uh, if you say uh, it like ideal uh, day, my home with my uh, parents and my sisters and my little nephew who is like growing so fast and I'm not there, but it's fine, it's fine, job is job. Is it hard to be a captain? Is it hard? Uh, it's not hard to be captain, it's a privilege to be captain, but uh, like always I say it's uh, Captain is privilege, but uh, I think every girl is captain in the team, you know, every girl brings in the team something special So yes, I have that opportunity and I am of course really grateful that I'm captain not of the great players They're amazing persons. You have a little bit more extra pressure to be honest because uh, you need to be the role You know when I become the captain, I was like, okay, I cannot party so much. Sorry <laughs> I'm kidding, but it's uh, yeah, you need to always be on your top, uh, you need to train well, you need to be example. It's really important for young girls to have someone to lead them and to show, show them. So I am uh, really uh, trying every day to do my best uh, on the trainings, on the games. So yes, to help the team, what's the most important. Good vibes only. So. Again, good morning, good people. Uh, this is uh, how I live most of the time. Now we go for training. Tomorrow we are flying to Samara and we need to earn some three points. So stay with us. Will you think about your uh, future career? Will you stay in the football like a coach or something like that? 
To be honest, I would like to be a sport director, <laughs> you know. I don't know, like, you know, I, uh, I'm now focused about uh, Saturday games. So, day by day, uh, if I will stay, I can say probably, but you never know what, uh, what is your destiny. So, I just uh, live, I want to be like happy every day, I want to do my job on the highest possible level and uh, let's see what future brings. But uh, what do you think? Should I be a coach? Good people. And um, the final one, teach uh, the followers uh, about some words in Serbian that everyone should know. Dobar dan. That means hello, good afternoon. I love you. That's important. Volim te. That's important. That's a really nice word. Volim te. Zapratite YouTube kanal Molim vas, žfk, csk, jako je bitno i molim vas, stavite like. Mi letim v prekrasni gorod Samaru. Tam, ja znam, što proizvodje rakete, da, po mom? Vot, i gotovim se, vot, ždjom naš rejs. I A ku vas jela čovjek? I nepanjatna ženčina stala misis Rasije. По непонятным причинам в Питере проходят суд из-за маленькой собачки по кличке Зимба. Преступник. Как прошел полет? Огонь, я спала. Марина, а ты что делала? Вот это вот. Все разговаривал? Почти. Как-то маловато, маловато. Вот спросите у этой дамы, что она делает. Что делает? Я спала. В эфире рубрика «Угадай мелодию». Погнали. Ну, вы помните, да, батончики как разыгрываются? Если погромче сделать, станем лучшими. Давай. Ай, вон она Кио, они сенды Токио, они сенды Мини 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 Кио. Понял, Леша? Да. Как дела? Хорошо. Были в Самаре? В Самаре. Нет, в первый раз. Гулять сегодня пойдешь? До магазина максимум. Тоже пойдешь со мной. Камера идет со мной, ты как хочешь. Мы поужинали. И сейчас решили немножечко прогуляться. Похоже на улицу Ростова и Краснодара, что-то вот между. Он нас ведет в церкви. Но Лёха говорит, она типа красивая. Если разочаруешь, меняй на себя. Читаем новости про акулу. А видео видел? Трэш. Нас встречает, вон. Ты не подкачал. Красиво. Я искупаюсь и выйду такая. Здравствуйте, это река Волга. Мы в Самаре. Ой, там, да, телефон. Там звонок, там можно позвонить. Давайте друг другу позвоним оттуда. А, нет. Это какой-то другой город, просто мне кажется, это в каком-то другом городе. Это в другом городе, да. Поставлены, так можно махать друг другу. Ну, позвони, попросила. Так давайте, и она их получит.
дублем? Ну, мне кажется, там автогол засчитали. Но я била. Тяжело, тяжелый матч, тяжело дышать. Я еле дышу. Спасибо. Коробич, что по матчу? Молодец, Лерочка. Ты начинала свою карьеру в Самаре. Каково это играется на футбольной родной земле? Историческая родина футбольная, да. Я начинала здесь, играла на этом поле в 2002 году. Кубок УЕФА с Инсбургом, тогда ЦСКА ВВС Самара играла. Мне еще тогда было совсем-совсем мало лет. Вот, поэтому, я думаю, все прекрасно посчитали, сколько мне было. Вот, ну, очень приятно, что здесь всегда, здесь всегда прекрасно. Это футбольный город, поэтому... Выиграли, поздравляю команду с тремя очками, поздравляю болельщика с тремя очками. Двигаемся дальше. Дальше нас ждет супер важный матч, поэтому будем готовиться. Всех победы. С Болом. Спасибо. Как оно? Очень здорово, очень класс. Эмоции только положительные. Ждала этот гол. Мы тоже все ждали, поздравляю. Спасибо. Yes, good game, good game. We are building, we are working hard. So next is Super Cup, so let's be ready for that. На Чили. На расслабоне.